So yeah, I'm back home. So I am back in my blue room. I am back in the OG room, but yeah, why are we here? What's going on? Take a seat on my bed with me. Let's chat. Okay. So if you guys know, last year I moved out with two of my friends and that's already been a year ago, guys. Like, what the frick? So I moved out, I moved out of home for the first time and moved out with some friends. We rented out a house and whatever. But now I am back, I'm back home, back with my parents, um, and it's just, it's not the most ideal, it's not exactly what I wanted to do, but it was the most logical decision right now. Now there's a lot I could go into, there's so much, you know, life has just kind of been hitting punches left and right for me this past year. And I'm still not like over them, I feel like. I feel like I'm still trying to process a lot and get through a lot. But ultimately the last month in April, uh, me and Steve, if you guys uh, saw him in some videos, him and I had to kind of make a decision <clears throat> whether to go find a place together or to separate for a bit and go back home. And ultimately we both came to the conclusion that <clears throat> although we'd really like to find a place together, it's not the most logical right now. Um, and it'd be better if we both went our own ways for a little bit and then hopefully maybe come back together. We don't know at this point, so. Um, there's, again, a lot of behind the scenes stuff. I don't know what I would like to get into or what I'd like to just leave private, but ultimately I'm back home for now. I don't know how long I'll be here. I don't know what this is going to entail, but, um, I'm, I'm here and now I, I really need to finish unpacking, but let me show you guys the progress of the unpacking because oh, it's so overwhelming y'all. So this is currently the state of the room. We have <clears throat> my movie shelf here, which I don't know what I'm gonna do there. I have my mystery machine stuff there originally. I don't know if I'm gonna do the same thing. We have my Scooby movie shelf. I need to put some of the merch there that'll fit. Um, running out of room though, I'm gonna have to start the next section once the next DVD comes out. We got a little Papa Scoob. We got the TV stuff, the fridge, um, and then my bed. And then we have, this is actually, I don't know if I ever showed this in a video before, but this is my grandparents' original record cabinet. Um, and so I took it off my sister's hands months ago because she didn't have the room for it anymore. Um, but yeah, so I have that there. Um, and yeah, so it, it's still a work in progress. It's still, you know, it's trying to figure everything out. My closet, I still have a lot to do in here. Um, you know, put stuff away. Maybe I can finally learn to play guitar. But it's, it's slowly coming. Let me show you the box situation. It's a lot better than it was, like, even yesterday, I'd say, because I got all my movies out yesterday, which that took out, like, a few boxes, but let me show you that situation because it's chaos. Everything I still need to put away. Part one. Then we have what's in here. This isn't as bad. There's still stuff, but um, yeah, I just <laughs> uh, yeah, and I have this futon now. I don't know if you guys even knew. Yeah, I got a futon a few months ago. And now here I am with it. If you guys remember, 
This is actually where I used to record. Everything's still set up here. Nothing's been taken down since. Um, it's just, there's stuff here that we gotta work out and stuff. But what I'm hoping to do is record here again, but I'm hoping to put the futon right here and then I can sit and do my videos instead of standing like I used to. Uh, I don't know, these m might not be in view if I sit. I don't know what we'll do with this, but I do wanna record here again and I wanna put the futon here. Um, and then once we can get this cleaned up and stuff too, then that's where I used to edit. And that's where I had my desk. My desk is currently over here. Um, I should show you guys too my current little temporary rig I have for my computer and stuff. Downstairs, um, it's... I'm trying to fix the exposure. Sorry, y'all. There we go. Um, so yeah, I have like a temporary setup downstairs to edit my videos and whatnot. Um, in the actual office room that we have here, but it's currently where we're at. Okay, what do we think of this? My one thing is the Scooby mug back there. But what do we think of this? I put it on the record player speakers. Let me know your thoughts here. But I also want to know, what are we thinking of this too? Um, you know, I have some of the Lego figures here, the little SD thing from Scoob. And then down here I have most of my Funko Pops, so all the Scooby Funko Pops down here. And then I have some other merch stuff. I might add a little more here depending, but let me know your thoughts down in the comments so far what y'all are thinking of this. Okay, we've made a little more progress actually. Luckily. <laughs> Up here I have this going on. Kind of trying to make it more of like a movie show, but I just have so much Scooby Doo stuff. And then over here here, I don't know if I've changed anything actually since I last showed. Um, we have this. It's hard to see. Oh, there we go. Smash or pass. Our first episode, which our anniversary is coming up for that. Our one year anniversary. Then we have stuff over here I showed you. Um, and I'm packing more of this stuff too. You know what the other thing that this means? We're back with the pups. Hey, yo. We just got Waywin and Bronx. Huh. You guys are gonna be in the videos again more, huh? Yeah. We're back with the pups. Hello. Hey, hi. Hey, Yeah. Okay, but the difficult thing now, though, is since I've been gone for a year, you know, my parents haven't had to get food for me so like i'm like what do i eat in this house anymore i don't know like we got to start working on getting the food that i like and eat more here again so i'm just like i'm rummaging through all the pantries and the different refrigerators and stuff being like what could i cook up Ooh, i could do i could do a quesadilla done a lot of those recently though to be honest I'm kind of like over those at the moment kind of 
It's 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 rough. It's rough. <laughs> Get it? Cause dogs say. Hmm. Also, I really need to show you this again. Random. This is what happens when you can see yourself recording. You pay attention to stuff. <laughs> so um, hey, it's a few days later. I got the unpacking done. I have my earbuds in. I'm yeah. That's what these are. Anyway, so I got the I got all the unpacking done. So I'll show you guys the room right now. It's still like not 100 percent And honestly, like today I was trying to find something. I can't find stuff. I'm like, all the boxes are gone. Where did I put stuff? Um but let me show you the boxes are gone. So that was the biggest thing. So in here, I got all the boxes gone. Those are my blankets. I need to steal them back. And then this is my poster. I originally had this poster in my room up above the door, but I couldn't get it to stay. I don't know what I did. I need to figure that out because I do want it back there. Um, I, I don't know what to do with this. I don't know where to put it. It's all my video games. And then this is where, again, we will film and edit, but we got to work on this so to be done tbd to be done at a later date but then this got all this done so again once we get that other room cleared out we can put the futon where we're gonna film and i got my mystery machine pillow i'll also put my hex girls what i'll also put my i'll also put my hex girls pillow there um again once we get everything moved and situated um but now let me show you my room we're back in the blue room let me show you okay nor the bed i always leave it undressed so i can just hop in whenever i want but we have my grandparents record cabinet i got a few cds there um and then the records are down there i got a bunch of christmas um and a handful of others but i also have like old records from my grandparents then i put the speakers here um, and then have my Lego thing and Scooby mug. This is kind of chaotic right now. I need to clean it up. There's Mr. Boo for now, just for now. Closet is, yeah. Then here's my movie shelf. So I have like all my Hanna-Barbera here and then my series sets. I want to finish the Twilight Zone. Um, and I have like my Blu-rays here. Obviously I have more movies in the back and I have more stuff in the back of there too. And then this is mainly like my Disney stuff right here, mainly. I mean, there are some Disney here because they're Blu-ray, 4K and whatever, but mainly my, uh, most of my Disney's here. Then right now, this is what I got. I don't know why this is so, I had that turn like that. This is kind of what I got, I got my Switch thing here. Um, and then down here, it's very minimal right now, very bare bones. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. I don't want like a ton here because eventually I'm gonna have to put more movies and stuff here, but if you guys have any ideas, let me know. And up here we have, I try to make it more of like a movie-esque thing. So I have like an old um, camera here and then some actual film reels here um, that I've had for a few years now. I got my scoop thing and then I got the poster for Scooby-Doo 2. And over here we have my Scooby movie shelf. You know, so here's how this turned out. We got one of my favorite Scooby portraits I've ever owned. Um, but then all the movies. And then down here I have all my Funko Pops. I have the signature from C. Ernest, who was Minor 49er, and the janitor in Mystery Begins. And then my Scooby Doo 2 CD, some cards. Funko stuff, Mystery Machine mug, and I have my Scoob Mystery Machine, and the figures are in there too, I have my Scoob thing there, then my TV, my TV light is turning on, I have it set to like turn on at a certain time, and then my mini fridge, and yeah. So that's kind of the gist of my room right now, I'm, I don't know if I'll hang stuff back up on the metal wall, this never left, I never took that down, so it's just, just still up there. Um, the, but, uh, blah, blah, blah. the other thing I meant to show you guys too 
is kind of my temporary setup of how I'm editing and stuff right now. Also, ignore what's going on down here. We have a really old pup, and she just sometimes can't make it outside anymore. So if you see, like, the gates and stuff, we're just trying to keep her off of the carpet and the pads. We're trying to keep her off of the carpet because she just can't make it outside anymore. Um, she turns 17 a week from today recording this. And that's Waylon growling. But let me show you my temporary setup right now. Waylon is being on guard. I don't know of what. But here's what we have right now. So I have my computer, my monitor, keyboard, and everything. Hard drive. And it's, it's kind of a mess. But you know what? Until I can get my desk set up and whatever, I was like, so that I can work. Here we go. So this is what I'm working with right now. This is also why we're not doing streams for a hot minute until I get situated. Once we get that other room all figured out and, you know, everything in its place and whatever, we'll do streams again. I want to slowly get back into those. Slowly. So that's kind of the plan. If anybody is wondering, that's why we're not doing streams right now. Um, streams will happen again once we get that all situated and settled and... Yeah, so welcome back home. Um, yes, I'm back home uh, with my parents. Again, It's it's been a whole situation. Um, nothing necessarily bad, it's just how life played out, really, and led me back here. Um, I'm sorry, he's so cute. Hold on. Stop being so cute. Like, is that, is that a possibility? Stop it. But yeah, it's just kind of how life played out, and we're here. Um, yeah, this, this is what we're doing right now. Uh, I don't know how long I'll be here, how long... Things will plan out. I have tentative future plans, but we're honestly kind of letting the universe decide at the moment of what's going to happen because I don't know. I'm I'm trying to figure a lot of stuff out. I'm very overwhelmed. I'm very um, stressed and not in the best mental place, to be honest. Um, I have my mental health for this last year, honestly, has been going... And right now it's and I'm just like hmm, I'm trying to just survive one day at a time right now. That's literally what I'm trying to do right now is just wake up and be like I can make it through the day. I can do it. You know, I'm going to be very honest with y'all. That's where I'm at right now. I'm like hmm, one day I cannot think about tomorrow. I cannot think about next week. I can't think about a month from now. I just, just today, we are here. Mm. So anyways, yes, there is kind of a life update, kind of where I'm at and moving back. Again, I will probably do a stream and answer any of your guys' questions that you might have. But if you do have questions right now, you can throw them in the comments, and I will answer what I can, what I feel comfortable. I might not answer all questions, to be honest, but um, let me know. Let me know your questions down in the comments if you have any of stuff. Um, just let me know. So, but yeah. <sighs> My hope and intent is to get back more consistently on YouTube. I can tell you that right now. I really, really want to get back consistent with YouTube. And right now, what consistent means to me right now is the bare minimum one video a week. That's what I'm going to shoot for right now. So, I'm not going to promise anything with streams right now. That'll happen when it happens. But video-wise, I want at least a video a week. So, that's what we're going to shoot for. But... Anyways, guys, there's just kind of a quick little vlog update thing. Hope you guys are all doing good. Let me know how y'all are doing in the comments. I'd love to hear. Are you guys, you know, surviving? Thriving? Or are you kind of in a... Like me. 
you know what? If you are, that is okay. That is okay. We will all push through. So let me know. Let me know how you guys are doing in the comments. I want to I want to chat with you guys. So, it's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Welcome back to my blue room. Um, yeah. I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs> Goodbye.